here for watching South Georgia Hot Shot. All right, so we are unloaded now. And there's nothing coming out of this area. So, like I said before, I kind of figured I would be deadheading out of Wyoming. And I took this load because it was only 34 more miles deadhead to Salt Lake. Um, my brother found some land, like I said, that we want to go look at this weekend. So I might start deadheading that way. I got lead on the boards looking at the boards. Let me just say, I'm going to clear this up. If I could live anywhere, it would be Colorado. I've always said I want to live in Colorado. I mean, you have the mountains and the greenery. You know, Utah is, depending on the part of Utah, most of it's desert. God, Colorado is amazing. And their hot chick to ugly chick ratio, way more hot chicks than ugly chicks. Very fat some beautiful women in Colorado. It seems like everywhere I go, they're just, they're just crawling out of the woodwork. Too bad freight sucks here. That's the big major thing. Why I wouldn't live here is because there's nothing that comes out of Colorado. They contribute nothing to the world. They take everything in. I mean, they might send a little little things out here and there, but if you get on the load boards, you'll see that it's usually like, it's usually like 10 to 1. 10 loads coming in for every one load going out. And sometimes it's even worse than that. So, I don't know. Let me get these 4 by 4 strapped down, though. And uh, we'll hit the road. See if we can find something. I hope we do. I, I, I get pretty lucky, I'm not going to lie. I get... My buddy John, the guy with the white truck, he's always telling me, he's like, dude, you're the luckiest son of a bitch ever. And I really am. I do get lucky. I'm super blessed with what I have, I'm not going to lie. Um, I, I, I'm lucky. You know what they say, though. It's, it's better to be lucky than good. I don't know why. Uh... This is hard to do with one hand. Let me hop off of here. I'll talk to you guys in a bit. A few moments later. All right, you remember how I said I was lucky? We just found us a load going to uh, Hayburn, Idaho. It's supposed to be a truck body that's uh, 6,500 pounds, uh, 25 feet. I think she said seven feet tall. I don't know what kind of truck body it is. So uh, we're about to... Uh, about two and a half hours from it now and that'll put me uh that'll put me about a hundred miles from salt lake city so it would have been it would have been uh what would it have been 340 miles i think deadhead so this this will put me 100 miles from salt lake so, uh, super excited about that. What do you think, Lita? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go.
Well, this looks like what we're picking up. It's only supposed to be 6,500 pounds. This thing looks massive. It's huge. Uh, it was only supposed to be 25 feet. I'm pretty sure that's more. That almost takes up my whole trailer. I don't know, I'll throw a tape measure on it. See what we can do here. All right, this is what we ended up with. When I, uh, the broker said it was a truck body. I was thinking it was a truck body. This is a different kind of truck. I don't know that uh, it would make a difference. Uh, like I said, this is supposed to be 6,500 pounds and 25 feet. I did uh, measure it off. It's, it's really close to 25. They've got this pump back here hanging by these little wires. So I'm gonna find something else to hold that thing up a little better so that thing doesn't snap off because all that uh, vibration and bouncing, that wire would eventually end up breaking. So all I gotta do is do that. I wanted to chain it down. Nowhere to really chain it down to. This metal's pretty thin. And uh, it's the same type of metal all the way up and around. There's not really anywhere to chain it down too good. Uh, no, but that's it. I had a step thing that folds out. I had to take off because it was sticking out a little bit. But uh, there it is. We're going to Idaho. Idaho, Utaho.
We are on uh, 50 West in Colorado. And tell me, that is not amazing. Oh my gosh. It's a double rainbow. Whoa, that's a full rainbow. All the way. Double rainbow. Oh my God. It's a double rainbow all the way. Whoa, that's so intense. Or does he say it's a triple rainbow? Oh my goodness. Wow. I'm gonna be an hour short from making it to my brother's house tonight. Kinda <laughs> sucks. I'll be sleeping in the truck. Oh man. But look at that. Colorado is amazing.